Wednesday is brought to you by Adventist Health. Welcome back up to the kitchen. We have Chef Matt Payne with Morrison Healthcare at Adventist Health. And today we also have Dr. Ayed, who's the director of the Wellness Center there. Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. For so what are we making today? All right, so today we're making cauliflower rice or riced cauliflower uh, with shishito peppers and ahi tuna. Um, so a lot of things we talk about, we talk about substitutions and cauliflower rice is a great substitution for rice. So Why would we want to do that instead of regular rice, Dr. Ayed? So if you're following a low-carb diet, or trying to reduce your carb intake, it's a perfect substitution. You don't feel deprived, you have an option instead of regular rice. Okay. Yeah, it's a great way of just putting things to put alternatives that are low carb. Okay, doctor uh, or chef, would mm -hmm. you suggest like ricing your own cauliflower? Yeah. Like do you just buy it frozen? There, there's two like? ways to do it, you can buy it frozen, that's the easiest way to do it. If okay. not, if you have a head of cauliflower and you're like, oh, I wanna make this, just take your box grater and then on the kind of the biggest oh, okay. one, just, just grate it up. Grate away. Okay, that's yeah. easy. Okay, great, yeah. so we've got mm -hmm. the frozen kind in here and we're just yes. sauteing it some hot olive oil. Yeah, so a little bit of olive oil uh, and then really hot pan. Uh, if you cook slowly, it's just gonna mush out. Oh which yeah, is what we don't, we don't want, want. No so mushy. Um, so you want hot pan, you we're gonna get a little bit of color on it. Uh, and in a second, we're gonna add our shishito peppers. Ooh. I love shishito peppers. Um, just sauteed, it's also called a padron pepper, you can see it from that. Okay. Uh, the best thing about them is one out of 10 is spicy. So well, nine of them will be totally mild <laughs> and great. So you're sitting around eating them with your friends mm -hmm. and you know, somebody grabs one, it's like, oh. So it's a surprise yeah. in every bite. Exactly. <laughs> you never know what you're going to get. Mm -hmm. yeah. Do you put some garlic in there too? Yeah, a little bit of okay. garlic in here. Love. Uh, then we're going to add some cardamom and coriander mm. and also some smoked paprika, which is oh, going to give yeah. us a nice little bit of color to this okay. and a little bit of that smoky flavor. Would this be, would you serve this for a side dish? I see you're going to top it with some, uh, yeah. some protein mm -hmm. over here too today. So again, this is, this is just like rice. So this is kind of that substitute for it. Okay. So. Put in a little bowl. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, so we're going to saute our peppers. It's very rich in vitamin K and you still got the... You know, the olive oil, you mm -hmm. got the omega-3 fatty acids, reducing your triglycerides. So you're putting things together that give it the best taste and still good nutrition value out mm -hmm. of it. Do, does cauliflower have good nutritional value? Yeah, it's a, you know, it's a great vegetable. You still get nutrition out of it. And at the same time, it's, it's filling. I mean, you're not going to feel hungry right after, like, consuming a lot of carb and feeling the hunger after. Okay. All right, great. So we're just going to saute this up just yep. until it's warm through, basically. Yeah, you want, think al dente, right? Okay, so al dente. you want still a little bit of tooth to it. Um, if you cook the shishitos too much, they turn that olive oil or olive color, which mm. we don't want. We don't want army green vegetables. Oh, okay. so you want bright, vibrant, and still a little bit of firmness. To yeah, it. it is so pretty. Mm -hmm. uh, if we can see the color on these, these peppers right here, they just look so beautiful and vibrant for mm -hmm. spring. Yeah. Nice little springtime recipe. And then as that's finishing cooking, we okay. also seared some tuna. So salt, pepper, and something called harissa powder, uh, which mm. is a northern African spice blend. Uh, I love it. It's it's a little bit of paprika and, and cumin, mm. uh, a little bit of chili in there too. So it does have a touch of heat to it. Okay. Uh, you're going to find in paste, this is the powder. Um, nice and just sear, really easy, hot pan, um, and about 15 seconds on each side. Okay. That's it. So. All right. We're going to slice it mm -hmm. up. Yeah. So adding lean protein is great, you know, you you get kind of a good source for your lean muscle and you still get some, uh, you know, fullness sensation after having some lean protein in. Mm -hmm. uh, you don't have saturated fat in it, so you're getting kind of a good source of a, a lean protein. Mm -hmm. Is seafood a good tuna. choice for lean protein often? Yeah, okay. absolutely, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm, man, that smells good. I can smell those peppers. Yeah, so you have a little bit of color on it and then we're great. just going to put it on our plate. Okay. So you got a complete meal here. Exactly. You know, Beautiful. That's perfect. And then and you've got a see. little garnish over there too, yep. I see. This on top. And then just a little bit of mint. It's gonna give it a little bit of vibrancy. Mint. Yeah. Yes. Very interesting. Okay. Yeah. And that's good for digestion mm -hmm. and okay. it's still good for your brain health too. Yeah. yeah. All right, can And I that's it. Go go for it. Okay, here we go. Yeah. I wonder which pepper I'm gonna get. The one <laughs> in the ten or the nine out of the ten. Looks great. Mm, okay, this was the nine out of the ten. Not too right. spicy, but <laughs> <laughs> really delicious. I love all the different flavors in there from the cardamom. I can really taste that. Mm -hmm. And just the different spices, the paprika. Really yummy and flavorful. We'll post this website, or we'll post this recipe on our website, kget.com, so you can try it out as well. Thank you so much for coming in this thank morning. You. We appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. We'll